see you in a second. Ah, oh, hello again, Ms. Reed. You. I have questions for you. Of course. Come, admire this painting with me, and I'll answer all your little questions. Okay, asshole. You know Cordelia. <coughs> you work for her. You're going to tell me everything you know. Please. This sort of brash display might work on terrorists with double-digit IQs, but here? Honestly. Do you have a warrant? Were you not in fact extended an invitation that allows your continued presence here? And can that invitation not be rescinded? Now I have said all that I am allotted to say about Ms. Smith. Listen. I don't care what sort of games you want to play. If there is anything going on here not in line with the law, I'll make sure you hang by it unless you speak up now. In that case, it sounds like we have both said our piece on the matter. I suggest that you keep the tone of any future exchanges between us more cordial than this one has been. Especially if you wish there to be future exchanges. Just before Max Smith's death, you were working on something with him. I need to know what. Unfortunately, those were private matters. Nothing I can disclose to you. There was a lot of strife in the family at this time, but it seems like you and Max got along pretty well if you were working together. Are you playing some sort of game? Getting me to discuss the fight I had with Max just prior to his death won't implicate me in anything. You surely already know that an FBI agent was here and asked all about this. Asked about what? What fight? A small scuffle. We were in his office one night, burning some old documents. A fire was going, and he started with some hot-headed accusations. He'd been getting increasingly paranoid, and this was its peak. Okay. I'm ashamed to say I lost my composure. I struck him. Struck him? What, you gave him a backhand or something? This was not one of my prouder moments. I had Cordelia's silver necklace in hand. I swung and gave him a hit on the head. Nothing severe. That's all I'll say about this. Do you know anyone named Jeff Therian? Do I know anyone? No. What an odd question. It seems to me you should know who Jeff Therian is. You put together and signed some documents that had his name on them. I haven't done them. such a thing in years. That may be true, but that doesn't change the fact. Well, let me I've signed a great many assholes. official documents in my time, Agent. You can't expect me to recall one document out of hundreds. You're just standing here looking at the painting? Indeed. You've been looking at it for a little while. You were educated in a far more fast-paced and self-indulgent era, so let me explain. I am not standing here begging to be taken somewhere by a fleeting entertainment. Actual art, my dear, requires something of you. Hard work. So yes, an hour with the painting is not uncommon for me. What do you do here exactly? As I already said, I am the Smith family lawyer. At one point, Cordelia's brother Max and I worked long hours getting together all sorts of business plans, working out business models. Now my role is something a bit more lackadaisical, keeping the minor business details in order, doing a few consultations here and there, looking after the towers. Well, keep watching the paint dry. I need to go. And if you're hiding something from me... I wouldn't do anything to obstruct the workings of the law. I am a lawyer, after all. Exactly.
nyt sen saa ottaa. This is the necklace that Scorobius was talking about. The one he struck Max with. Nyt näiden voi tehdä ton... Regression. You have to stop this insanity about telling Keith and Cordelia. Max, I've told you a thousand times why we have to do it like this. There are legalities involved. Things that you are better off letting me handle. I've been reading about how you handled it. What have you been doing snooping around in my basement? Educating myself. I might not have understood why you used me to get Keith to sign all those documents over the years. <laughs> but I understand it now. My parents weren't trying to punish me. They didn't set up our inheritance to go through Jeff Therian. It was you. And there uh. were people who wouldn't mind knowing about this. You know, people who bang gavels. Or maybe one of those FBI agents that were just here. Of course. Because you can wash your hands of it. You've done what you must to take the money from Jeff down to the last penny you've spent. Yes, I told some lies and I broke some laws. I can own up to that. But Cordelia is asking questions and Keith is getting suspicious. Look at this. That was my mother's passed on to Cordelia, but Keith had it. They know something is wrong here and they're working together to find it out. I won't let you pull my family apart. I trusted you all these years, so now I'm going to ask you this, and I'll ask it once. What is this? You would never understand. All uh. you do is moan about how much money you need and need and need. Here's the difference between us, Max. I don't need you or your pesky little sister for anything. Of course you don't. God. Cordelia sensed something was wrong. Why didn't I listen? Jeff has all the money. You made sure of that. And if anything happens to him, the money doesn't go to me or Cordelia. If he dies, it goes right to you. Get out uh. of my way. I'm calling those agents. I'll kill you before I let that happen. Out! Ah. Uh. Okay. Kaikessa rahasta kyse. Oh god. What was that? Is that going to happen? Is Scorobius going to hurt Max? Hey, Keith, there are a couple things I wanted to say. Okay, what things? Keith, there's something I need to tell you. I didn't want to bring it up before, but something's going on. I've been having these visions. What are you talking about? Look, I didn't want to upset you, but I've been seeing visions where Max gets killed. At first, I thought it was me who killed him, but... Something is going on between Max and Scorobius. I'm worried. And now, I find out Scorobius has some kind of secret room in Max's office. Killed? Are you sure about this? Uh, I know you're good at predictions, but... Trust me, Keith. This is real. I know about the elevator. I had a work area in the basement until Max and I got into that fight. He said he'd need to rethink my privileges, and he changed the code. I need to get into that room to find out what's going on. Mm, I don't know the stuff. code anymore, Cordelia. Believe me, I'd love to find out whatever it is that they're doing and drag it into the daylight. Is there any other way we can get down there? No, the elevator is the only way. But wait, I know. I have something here that can help us. When we're done here, I'll fill you in. Hey, I just wanted to say I'm sorry about what happened with those agents earlier. I didn't want to upset you, but I needed to help Max. Yeah, well, I guess I understand. But you can imagine how it feels to be in that position, right? To be taking a hit for him when he wouldn't take one for me? You shouldn't be so hard on him, but I do understand. 
and all I can do is say I'm sorry. We'll sort through this. Okay, if that's all, take a look at this. Okay. So, rocket what is it? It's the rocket ship from the Ori that's upstairs. The thing with the planets. I outfitted it with a camera. I was going to use it to find out what Max has been hiding from us, uh -huh. but this is the perfect use for it. If you bring it down, we can use it to capture the code we need. I'll get the camera ready. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Tänne pistää ihan rehellisesti vaan taas kun asiat ei yritäkään piilotella sitä. You need to set it up on Max's. Okay. Okay, let's set this up on Max's desk. Hmm. There's really no And here's the camera. Just put it on and it'll be ready to go. Okay, it's set up. Now we just need Scrobius to enter. I need to finish doing everything in here. Okay, so it fits in right here. How do I get this to turn on? Press the button. I did. I have to talk while you're holding it down. Press it again. See, it only turns on if it hears my voice or Max's voice. I'm going to put the Ori back upstairs. Okay, everything is back to the way it was. Great. We hardly saw anything. Yes, but those sounds. I think that... Yeah, that must be it. I got it! You both need to get out. Get away from the desk. Get. Out. I need time alone. I need time to think. But Max, Cordelia and I were just about to... Keith, I don't care. I'm serious. Get out. Get that now. Hit, hit that with us. Something's up. But there'll be no talking to him until he calms down. Hmm. Asshole. Look, Keith, he's under a lot of pressure. Something's been up with him lately. W what's wrong with giving him some space? You know how he is. You're... Defending him? Something's going on, Cordelia, and you won't even acknowledge it! I'm not going to have this talk right now, Keith. Don't make me pick sides. Right, because if you had to pick, we both know who you'd choose, don't we? Keith, no! I can't do this without you. I need that code. Erica, you might be my only hope at this point. Uh huh. Okay, Erica. I know you can see me. I just hope you'll help me. I really need some help right now. Okay, let's pass it with. Okay. I don't know what to do anymore. 
I can't keep carrying this. But I can't tell anyone. I can tell you, Dad. But you'll probably just hate me for it. I'm, I'm sorry, Dad. I'm sorry. I feel like I'm failing. Just want you to talk to me again. Hey. Word document. I was thinking about what you said before. You said John never came in here, right? Never was in the towers? Correct. Now would you stop harping on it? Sure, now that I know where things stand. See? I found John's lighter upstairs. So I know he was here, and I know you two are mixed up in something. Christ. Look, John was in here, yes. But I won't be talking about it. This wasn't meant to be any of your business. As I said, the situation is delicate. Okay, nyt se on saatu valheistakin, valheistakin. I think I'm ready. Agent, I'd advise. Okay, here goes. Let's see if I can push him just a little bit over the edge. I found something interesting, Director. Maybe you can explain it to me? Now what? I found an old document upstairs. It seemed harmless enough, but I did some digging and found out that sure enough, this Jeftharian that nobody seems willing to talk about is mentioned. In an investigation you were heading up. Congratulations, Agent. You've discovered how to use the FBI database every agent in the office has access to. Interesting you'd say that, because I actually had to have a handwriting analysis run on the documents because these records weren't in the database. They were deliberately misfiled. And at the bottom, detailing who filed the reports as lead investigator, none other than Samuel McAdams. Now correct me if I'm wrong, but burying a case in order to protect yourself? You better stop right there, oh. Agent! Now we're getting somewhere. Get off me! Get your damn hands off me! What the hell do you think you're doing? You've crossed the line, Agent. Leave this building now! And I'll see you in the morning. This isn't over. Okay, I'm holding down the button. Now what? I don't understand why you won't let this go. There's nothing going on here. 
I have no idea who set me up here, but I promise you, you are wasting your time! Now, if you don't... Bada boom ding dang. <laughs> Been hanging around Terrence too much. Oh. John? Ei se missään ole täällä talosta tuonne pas. Noni. Enter the code. I don't know the code, but it should be somewhere on this video. I don't know the I'll need to get that glitchy video cleaned up. Uh... Okay, Terrence, I've got a corrupted video recording. Mm. But I'm sure you have something in your bag of tricks to help me out here, right? In hands. Wow, Terrence got back to me already. He must be really pounding down the energy drinks tonight. And there goes Terence's software to the rescue. Okay, I've attached the camera. There we go. That's how it's meant to play. That's it. That's the code. Time to find out what the Enthon Towers are hiding. Okay, what is Scorobius hiding down here? It's locked. Damn. This is the place from my vision. The one where I... I just need to be careful. There's... There's something written on the wall, but it's too... Sounds like... like Max! Oh no. Max? God damn it! That sounded like John. And it came from back in the direction of the elevator. 
No. Hey, it's unlocked. Cordelia? Cordelia? Max, this... This is how it happens. Why, Max? I don't understand. Hey. Shh, shh. We are going to get out of here. Help me find a way out. We'll worry about the rest later. Okay. <gasps> Max! Cordelia, you need to stay calm. Breathe. Yes. We gotta hurry, Cordy. Max! I'm scared. I know. I am too. I need you to focus. Max, he's in pretty bad shape. I can stop this. Just like Rose told me, visions aren't true until they happen. It's a digital camera. I can't! My wrist... Buttons there. Ah! Max! Oh, oh, no! Is that a number three? There's a message back there. We have to find out what it says. I th think so. Which one do you want me to press? Do the second one. Let's go with five. The last one. Six. The number two. The number one. Is that a number three? There's a message back there, but something's blocking it. We have to find out what it says. Another combination. Press number one. Let's go with five. The last one. Six. The number four. Another combination. Is there a pattern here? Fourth one. Let's go with five. The last one. Six. I can't. Another combination. Is there a pattern here?
Three. Let's go with five. The last one. Six. There's a message back there. Oh my god! Max! There's a message back there, but something's blocking it. But something's blocking it. You have to find out what it says. It's a can. This must be. Oh, God. I can't. Yes, you can. No, Max. This is the gun that. Listen to me. You are in control of the future, not your visions. You. Fine. Listen. Already. Take a deep breath. Keep your eyes steady. Line up the can in the sights. You can do this. Oh, make it slide. All right. We no time to ah! Oh, oh no. Oh, make it slide. I'm, I'm losing it, Cordelia. I'll get you out! I see it now. It says, only his life will set you free. What does that mean? Max, what does it mean? Cordy, I want you to promise me one thing. Do not... I got you to have a have answer. Behind bars. We'll find him. But for now, we've got to get out of here. Oh, oh. No. Oh, only one of us can leave this place alive. And he wants that person to be you. You have to fire that gun before this machine kills you. What? You have to save yourself. No, Max! Please, Cordelia, do it and get out of here. Only me. John, what the hell is going on? First you call me and tell me to stay put, then you disappear, only to run off and work for McAdams. What's with all the secrecy? You have some serious explaining to do. I do. Red, you're gonna hate me for saying this, but I think I could have stopped Scott's death. Wait, you mean you knew about this? You've known all this time, and you never said anything? Stop fucking around and talk to me! What do you know already? I know that Cordelia is our killer, the Oracle. And I know you knew her. Ah, she was a good girl. Yeah, you know, I, I should have listened to her. Something was gonna happen to her brother. Did she kill him? No, but we blamed her for it. 
It was too obvious, Red. She comes to me saying her brother was gonna get killed. And when he turns up dead, what are we supposed to think? That she could really predict the future? It was only later that I realized... That her power was real? That people like her and me exist? I've seen weird shit, yes, but Cordelia didn't defend herself. She admitted to having killed him. To this day, I'm still trying to find out why. Who is Jeff Therian? Not a clue, Red. I'll tell you what, though, I'd give up donuts to find out, though. It has something to do with Scorobius. You think it might be him? There's got to be an answer here. I tried to go over this stuff, but I, I could barely see anything in here. Why did you leave me in the dark, John? Uh. We're partners. We're supposed to be working together. Almost three years after Cordelia was sent to jail, new evidence came up that proved she was innocent. Wasn't that clear from the report? There was some stuff that didn't match, of course, but you have to understand. She took the blame, and it was... It was easy. If this had gotten out, gotten to the press, they would have nailed us to the fucking wall with it. The whole department, especially after hey, all the evidence, it didn't make stuff. sense. So, top brass just sealed it up all tight. Erica, please help me! The few of us that did know about it, we were told to keep quiet. And Cordelia agreed to it. She didn't want any press involved. She just wanted her life back. Didn't she try to help catch the real killer? No, she said she wouldn't take it to the press, or press charges, as long as we didn't involve her in a new investigation. Did you release her? Yep. And she changed. When we first put her in the joint, it was like someone just had turned her off. Didn't care what happened to herself, didn't try to defend. Shit, they had to feed her with a glucose drip, because she wouldn't eat. When she was released, it was like she was someone different. Like that whole part of her life was amputated, forgotten, boom. Catching the killer didn't matter to her at all. Because she had her own plans. She's not only offing the killers the same way they kill, she's killing agents that fail to follow her instructions, her little clues. And it's because I failed to save Max. You mentioned Scott. Yeah. The day I released Cordelia, she told me about Scott. She said, she said you were about to lose him to the hands of a killer. Wait, what? And you kept this from me? I talked to Davies about it, but uh, Erica, our orders restrict the flow of info. God damn it, John. You kept this from me? You let my brother die? I'm sorry, Erica. I tried to be aware. Fuck you, John. You made the same fucking mistake twice. Did you even try to... Identify yourself. Keith. My name is Keith Smith. Holy shit. What happened? Did Cordelia do this to you? I don't. I don't know. I don't want to be here anymore. He's in pretty bad shape. He, he needs a hospital. Take him. And get the fuck out of here. I'm sorry, Eric. Really am. Just go. There's got to be something here. There are some papers here, some titles for Jeff Therian. They say he's got several million dollars. Look at this it's the Smith's will. The money was to be divided among the three siblings, signed by their parents. Wait, there's another one. This one is signed by Scorobius as the family lawyer. What? The money was left entirely to Keith. This must be why Max was so pissed at Scorobius. But why would he go through all that trouble?
Gorobius forged this. But why go through all that trouble? Wait, what's this? Jeff Therian is... Ah. Uh. Holy shit. He's Gorobius' son. Chase me. Shit! A note addressed to me? I've got a bad feeling about this. I'll take the note. There's a... Jeff Therian is the cane killer. Who is the cane killer? Yeah, that's what I want to know myself. Equal parts, books, and dust. Nothing's grabbing my attention. What was Keith doing over here in the dock? So sorry, Keith. It's another one of these. Think, Erica, think. I need a key to open it. Keith made all the antiques and devices for her. He must have refused to help her, so she forced him. He worked on projects for her. This is probably all he could do to stay sane down here. If he is still sane. There we go. Okay, here we go again. Who is the cane killer? Oh my god. This one has a second name on it. Jeff Therian. Why is it on Keith's plane release? This is all weird stuff. Every case you worked on, you hoped it had something to do with Scott's kill. He's been quiet for three years. Maybe the guy died, who knows? Had a heart attack. The guy was on fire last time anyone saw him, you know? That's the video kill that is that look in his eyes that was there when mom and dad died. Erica! Please help me! Keith? No! Ah. Uh. No! Do it! No! No! John, god damn it!
Aha. Ystävällismielistä tulitusta. Did you kill your brother, Mrs. Smith? Yes. Yes, I did. Joo, tää oli aika hauska. Hy hyvä, hyvä jakso siis. Vaikka niin teknisiä ongelmia oli alussa. Mutta niin, niin. Esimerkiksi kerran toi yllätti tosi, tosi hyvin. Kyllä. Eri, erinomainen. Tosiaan neljäsosa ei tainu ihan yhtä hyvä olla. Mutta tässä, tässä oli tosi hyvin yllätyksellisyyttä. Ja kiva, että, että se nyt tällä niin offlineina nauttaessa niin oikeasti niin pelitti. Varmaan Streamlabsista oikeasti johtuu, että se, se ei vaan 32 vittisiä sovelluksen nauhoittajia. En tiedä, mutta kuitenkin lopetan, lopettelen täällä, tällä kertaa täältä. Ää, kiitos katsomista. Yeah.